I'm Maya. Welcome back to my Pilates series. Today we have an intermediate workout to strengthen your lower abs. You don't need any equipment, so grab your mat, grab some water, and let's get started. If you're not able to watch this right now, please add to your watch later and join us when you can. Okay, go ahead and join me on your mat. So we're sitting, bending the knees, and then go ahead and grab behind your thighs. So from here, we're going to bring the chin to the chest, rounding into the low back, scooping into your belly, and just lowering down just to where the arms are straight. And then from here, I want you to curl forward, bringing your head towards your knees. And let's take that again. Let's use an inhale as you lower down. Think about trying to imprint your low back onto your mat. And then exhale, bring it back in. And let's take that again. We're rounding back, navel pulling into your spine. Keep a hold of the legs. So try not to let the hands slide down, but holding here, you'll feel that stretch in the back. And then curl back up. Two more here. Lowering down, lengthen out the arms, scoop into your belly. And then exhale, curl. One more time here. Rounding back. And then go ahead and curl back up. And now lengthen your spine. Reach your arms out in front of you. Tuck your chin to your chest. And then from here, let's start to roll all the way back with control. Melting your spine bone by bone. And then relax your head, neck, and shoulders. All right, now we're bringing both legs up to tabletop position. So think about your thighs pushing forward, you're pressing into your palms and opening up the chest. And then to start, we're keeping the head down and just extend your right leg out long in front of you. Feel your navel pulling into your spine and then bring that leg back in. And same leg, reaching out and bring it back in. So imagine there's a string connected from your abdominals to your knee and your abs pulling down into your back as with bringing your knee back in. And again, reach out. Scoop that knee in. Now from here, let's go ahead and bring the hands behind the head. Nice wide elbows. And we're going to curl the head up. So in that abdominal curl, stay here. Lift your shoulders off of the floor and then go ahead and stretch your right leg out again. From here, we're scooping that leg up and then lower down, reach again and lift. So we're recruiting those low abdominals to help bring that leg up again. We lift and lower down, reach. And let's take one more here, lift and lower down. From here, bend that right knee in Lower your head down, hands come down by your side, and then we take the left leg, reach out nice and long. Right leg is in tabletop. Pull that knee in, abdominals pull down into your back. Again, reach. You're stretching out from the hip and scoop. Take two more here, reach. And bring it in. One more, reach and then pull that knee in. Now from here, hands behind the head, wide elbows, curl your head up, shoulders coming off of your mat. Stretch your left leg out and we scoop that leg up. Feel your navel pulling down into your back and reach. Again, we have three. And lower. Two more. And lower and lift, lower down. From here, let's bring both legs to tabletop. Bring your hands down and you can rest your head, neck and shoulders. We're taking our toe taps. So taking the right toe, we're reaching the thigh forward and then scooping back up. So we're still focusing on pressing the navel down into your spine and up. Keep that going, right leg and scoop and left and again so really press the thighs forward and scoop 
keep that going, we have one more set with each leg. Right leg reaches and up and left leg. Now from here, flex your feet. So we're pushing out through the heels, both legs together. We're sending the heels towards the floor, scooping, bring it up and again, lower. And it's okay if this action is smaller. We want to focus on keeping the back down as much as we can as the low abdominals are activated. And again, reach and scoop. Let's take two more here. Reach the thighs and in. And take it one more time. From here, let's bring both knees into your chest. Take a second, feel free to open up the knees, stretch out the hips. And then we are going to keep the knees in, hands behind the head, and let's go ahead and curl the head up. Shoulder blades coming off of the floor. We're going to connect the heels. So open up your knees, give yourself a little space. Connect the heels, separate your toes as we stretch your legs out. Reach. So we're aiming for about 45 degrees. Bring it back in. And again, stretch. Scoop the knees in. Let's keep that going here. Reach. And scoop. Again, stretch. And in. We have two more. Knees scoop. And on this next one, stretch and let's heat, hold the legs out. We're taking circles. Just about as wide as your mat. And don't feel like you have to bring the legs all the way down. We're still trying to keep that navel to spine connection. And take one more circle here. And let's reverse it. We have four. And up. Keep reaching out from the hips. Inner thighs squeeze to bring the legs together. We have two. And one more. All right, now we're keeping the legs up at 90. Bring your head down, hands down by your side. Let's squeeze your heels together. We're revisiting our corkscrew. So from here, take your legs to the right. We're taking that circle down and around. Bring it to center. Take it to the left, down and around. And now you can keep your hips down as you do this again, or take that circle. And as you come back to center, lift the hips. Roll down through your spine. And let's take that to the left. So your choice, go with whatever the body feels is needed today. Press into your palms if you're taking that lift up. Really use the arms to help you control that roll down. And we lift, roll it down. One more time to the left. And lift and roll down bone by bone. Bring your knees into your chest. Give yourself a gentle rock side to side. And then from here, let's go ahead and stretch your legs out. We're going into our roll up. So digging your heels down into the floor, arms reach up to the ceiling. Let's curl the head up. We're peeling the spine off, reach. And stretch up and over your legs. Shoulders pull down, we're rolling back. Reach the arms, let's take that again, two more. Curling up. And stretch. And melt. Last one here, reach the arms. And one more, curl up, big scoop. And then go ahead and bring it back down. All right, bring both knees into your chest. We're taking our jackknife now. So similar to corkscrew, but without the circle of the legs. We're going to start with both legs up towards the ceiling. Press into your palms. Now from here, we're going to send the legs overhead, lifting your hips, and now reach your toes up towards the ceiling. And let's start to roll down with control. So press into your palms. You're scooping into your abdominals 
and you're melting down bone by bone. And it's okay if your lift is smaller to start, we can work our way up. Send the legs over, push the legs up towards the ceiling, and then start to roll down. Let's take two more. Sending the legs over and reach up and then start to melt bone by bone. You're scooping in and into the abdominals. And last one here. Sending the legs up and go ahead and start to melt. Now from here, bend your knees. We're going to rock up and take our teaser. So we're doing all three. So starting with our teaser number one, from here, we are reaching our legs up. So toes are reaching, fingertips are reaching. We're keeping the legs in the air and you start to lower your body down. So we're rolling bone by bone and then reach your arms back. From here, we're curling the head up and reach. Think about lengthening in the spine and let's start to roll back down. We have one more here. And again, curling up, reach. Staying here with the upper body, start to lower your legs down and lift. Again for two. And one more. From here, lower everything down, toes in line with your eyes. Let's reach the arms back towards your ears, big stretch. And we curl up, folding in half, reaching towards the toes, lifting in the spine. So you really have to scoop in the low belly and then start to roll back with control. Reach the arms back and let's take that again, two more. Curl up, draw your shoulders down, reach and fold in half. And then we're melting back down. Reach back one last time, curling up, fold in half, reach, and then go ahead and roll back down, reaching the arms back. Good. From here, bring the knees and take a second. Gentle rock side to side. And then let's go ahead and bring ourselves up. And now we're flipping over onto our stomach. So finding a forearm plank here, let's go ahead and stretch the legs out. We're lowering the hips down, pulling up into the spine. And then we're breathing here. We're holding for 10, nine, eight, seven. Feel your shoulders pulling down the back. Five, four, three, two, one, from here, hike the hips up. And then find your plank again. Now in this plank, go ahead and pull the right knee in and step that leg back. And left leg scoop. And back. And again, right. Step it back. And left. Now from here, same thing, let's add a lift of the hips, scoop. Find that plank, left leg, lift and scoop. And plank, let's take that again. We have three. And in. Two more. Really lift the hips, shift forward into that plank. One more set. And last one. And then from here, soften the knees. Let's go ahead and sit back towards the heels. Take that child's pose. Stretching out the arms. From here, go ahead and walk your hands to the left side of your mat. Send your hips over to the right. Take a little stretch here. And then go ahead and walk your hands over to the right. We're sending the hips over to the left. 
Breathe into that stretch. Then go ahead and bring it back to center. One more time, reaching out through the fingertips. Now from here, go ahead and come to sitting one more time. So we're bringing the legs in front of us. We are reaching the arms forward. Start to round into your low back. And then from here, press the palms together. We're taking a big twist to the right. We're pulling the elbow back and then twisting center. And let's take it to the left, big twist and center. Keep that going, twisting to the right, really letting your elbow guide you and center and take it left. Two more times, big twist to the right and center and left. Last one here, big twist and twist to the left. All right, from here, go ahead and come up and just take a gentle circle here, stretching out the back, stretching out the abdominals, as big as you can make it. Take one more in this direction. And then from here, go ahead and reverse. So we're opening up the chest and then closing it off. And we have two. And one more. And then go ahead and bring yourself up. Good work today and we'll end it there. Thank you so much for watching. If you love this outfit and would like to purchase one for yourself, please check out the shelf below. Stay tuned for the next video of my series and I'll see you then. Join us for 14 and 30 day programs, hour long classes, and much more on our yoga app, Yoga Plus by Psyche Truth. It's free to download and features a variety of wellness content, including yoga, fitness, Pilates, guided meditations, and interviews with dozens of wellness experts.